Hi everyone, this is Magical Desire. This is my first ever let's play ever. The game that I'm going to record is Corruption of Champions. This is a not safe for work adult text based adventure journey game. So you have to be above age 18 to watch me play. I will be reading a bunch of really loose words. If you are on public, please use your headphone. We will be making a new character. We grew up in the small village of Ingnam, a remote village with rich traditions, very deep in the wild. Every year, for as long as you can remember, your village has chosen a champion to send to the cursed demon realm. Legend has it that in years, Ingnam has failed to produce a champion. Chaos has reigned over the countryside. Children has disappeared, cross wielded, and this is spread like wildfire. This year, you have been selected to be the champion. What is your name? The name they are going for is... Yeah, it's a really long name. Gurgasha. Are you a man or woman? It's a man. What? You are a man. Your upbringing has provided you an advantage in strength and toughness. Yeah. What type of view do you have? Ooh, I like my man thick. What is your complexion? Mm, I'll go for fair. You select a Fair complexion. What color is your hair? Are they black? Black. Um, black. They will. Black. You can finalize your appearance customization before you proceed to product selection. You will be able to alter your appearance through the usage of certain items. Hmm. Let's see. Beard. Ooh, I like beard. You. You can choose your beard length and style. Style. Ooh, I have a goatee myself. Yeah, let's go for goatee. And then length is quite trim. Mine is quite short. Let's go for short. I have a beard, short black goatee. Yes. And then set height, I'm actually roughly 71 or so. Hmm. Let's make it 7 foot tall. 84, I think. Seven feet tall. Am a cock size? Oof. Mmm. Cock. Cock size. You can choose a cock length between four and eight inch length. Inch. Your starting cock length will also affect starting cock thickness. Ooh, damn thick. Cock type and size can be altered later in the game through certain item. Mm, good. Uh, let's just be honest, I'm only 5 inch. Oh, uh, wow, that's quite small actually. 9 inch. 0.9 inch thick. Mm. Uh, breast size. I'm flat, that's fuck. Actually, I'm, yeah, I'm flat, fuck. Every person is born with a gift. What's yours? Uh, I'm born with big girl. Nah, not really. Mm, let's see. Strong will kinda uh, armor character warrior. Uh, toughness will defend, fast will be quicker, smart will be magician deal, libido have sex, I think. Mm. Big cock. Mm. No, that's not. Uh, fast, I think speed will be much more better. Speed makes it easier to escape combat and grapple. It also boosts your chance of evading an enemy attack and susceptible to catching up to enemies who try to run. Ooh, good. Um, actually. Yeah, let's go for it. Fast. Hmm, cock. Before you became a champion, you have other plans for your life. What were you doing before? Oh, before I become a champion. I was still thinking, uh, that's not. Hmm. I would be alchemy, fighting, fortune, healing, religion, and I want to call religion. Like that. Schooling, slacking, slutting, smitting, and whoring. Mm hmm. Go fighting. You spend much of your time fighting other children, and you have planned to fight, find work as a guard when you grow up. You do. Oh, I grow up, want to become a guard, and my dream got crushed when I become a champion. 
you do 10% more damage with physical attack. You will also start up with 50 gems instead of his real share whatever. Game mode? Mm, normal will do. I hate difficult game. Would you like to play through the 3 day prologue in Ignam or just skip? Yeah, let's play that. Why not? Ooh, okay. Ignam is a rich and prosperous village despite its small size. There is already a well established array of shops with constant harm of tradesmen and merchants. The temples sit within views of the pagan seat. They at the table at the tavern which serve as a hub for people near and far to drink and dance. On the road leading out of plaza that sits before the temple is a trail that meanders away to a large farm in the distance. Looming ominously in the distance is a mountain known by locals as Mount Ilgas. Surrounding it now is a vast span of wilderness. Okay, let's just save for now. I think save data. Save. Okay. Okay, replace that. That was a testing character that I made. We know that. Okay, let's see. Perks. I think perk is yeah what we chose just now. Fast and history fighter. Stats nothing really different. Mmm, total girt. Cockland. Mmm, cock girt. Mmm. It's a super cock. Your nice prick is five inch long. My prick is not that nice. It's a weapon, it's my sword, okay? Hmm. Okay, let me check something, I'll be back in a while. Okay, I'm back. Okay, let's read the appearance actually. You are seven foot tall, male, human. With a solid build that displays a decent amount of muscle, you are currently wearing your comfortable clothes and comfortable loin clothes. Mmm, loin clothes. Suddenly we become Japanese. And using your fist as a weapon. Your face is human and shaped and structured with fair skin and somehow muscular and good jawline. Your short black hair look good on you. Accenting your feature well, you have a short black goatee pondering from your chain. You have a human shape with the usual torso, arm, hand, and finger. You have well formed thighs and your shapely toned backside fill up your clothing nicely. Two normal human they grow down from your waist and in normal human feet. You have two flat breasts. You like supporting one with a 2 0.2 inch bikini bow, I guess, and then yeah, 5 inch cock. And then uh, a boss, a pair of Balls about one inch a clock, they're quite small, so you know, one in a wait. Hmm, usually that's say Oh yeah, there we go. You have one virgin as so usually that's a virgin if you haven't been fucked in the ass, I guess. Okay, let's go explore. In this uh I'm playing the COC Corruption of Champion Revamp version. So the prologue is a revamp add on mod into the original game. I will put the link in the description. Explore. Explore the video of Vietnam. Well, for a while, but you don't find it interesting. Hmm. Then that shop, temple, in farm, inventory, we have nothing. This also is a revamp uh, change. They give you a shoe. And then upper underwear and lower underwear, I guess. Upper underwear is bra, you are female, while lower is your underwear, I guess. Me or female, you don't have those, I guess. The accessory, this will be a special item that you can get to make a thing, also can make or get. There's farm. As you make your way up to the dirt road, to the farm, you immediately see the west wonderful arch of crops, rice in house, and dairy meal idling gaze in the field by a large feather worn barn, a wooden windmill crack quietly nearby a quaintly two-story homestead. You hear a rustle from the swaying cornfield and instantly tense up to fight. To your relief is the farm owner who emerged. The farmer is a woman of Irish build and she is modest scarf in overall wiping away her sweaty blonde lock from her Oh my god that will look very ugly actually. Blonde lock from it's like her face will be full of hair like cow sticking mm. I heard rumor that you are going to the to be the champion of Ignam. Is that true? 
I don't even try to pronounce that name. The young farmer asked nervously, You affirm so probably yes, you are the next champion? Yeah, I am the next champion. Jill started to well up in her eyes and her voice began to crack with emotion. I've known you since you were a kid. Bitch, I can't believe I won't be seeing you again, Gergashar. This has to be some mistake. You embrace her and tell her and tell the shaking farmer why is she shaking. That is for the good of the village. Her tears start rolling down her red done cheeks. You stroke her hair. Ew. Whispering that everything will be fine. Ooh, did we slap with her? Mm. Well, it didn't say my cock is a virgin. It just say my ass is a virgin. So I guess we slap with her. Are you okay? After talking about your upcoming task, the farming girl calm down and ex offer you some jam. You can still work here if you want. If you're here to get some jam, I'll pay you five jam for each hour. Okay. So if you work, we can work here to get some jams. Jams is money in this game, I guess. Let's work. You let the farmer know that you're here for the work for the farm. Great, I could use a hand harvesting crops. Crops, the crops. But we need five full baskets of crops. She escorts you to the field where the crops grow and she hand you the basket so you can collect the crops. We harvest the crop. You only need to fill five. I'll take care of the rest, she say. You pick up the corn from the Plant one by one and put them into the basket. This continue under the basket. Get full after which you switch to another empty basket. You get back to harvesting and repeat until all the baskets are full. The farmer come to see what you feel. All the basket. Good work. I take care of things from here. Here's your payment. She say. She hand you the five gems. You feel a bit stronger from all the hard you done. You walk back home. And from the way that we gain two strength, I think, or one. I didn't really check. Then we increase our fatigue. Fatigue is kinda like our fatigue bar. You, if you want to cast magic, you use fatigue. If it's full, you'll be too tired to move. You need to rest. Something like that. You need to rest to reduce that. And there's in. Ooh, I love the in. The inn is a cozy little note that excludes a warm and welcoming air. You see several gasmen roaring and laughing over a few stein and a hand of card, and some time for chatting with about random topic. The innkeeper stands behind a polished wooden counter, serving beverage to his patron and cleaning up spilled drinks. Ooh, you can order some drink. I love beers. What kind of drink would you like? Five gen for a beer, two gen for a milk, three gen for a rubber. Who? I just want beer. Mmm. The gem that I just earned, I just use it. <laughs> like a glass of beer, please. You stay, you hand over the five gen to the innkeeper, and he pour your glass of beer. You kick back and drink the beer slowly. Here you see, we kind of reduce our intelligence. I don't know why, if you drink beer, it reduces your intelligence, and somehow it increases your libido. Okay, so increase my sex drive. Is that what beer do to it? Make you stupider and then increase your sex drive? What the fuck? You also can order food here? You take a seat and look at the menu. You, you, what would you like? And send me soup, hard biscuit pack, trailer pack. What these two mean is that you can buy these two? Uh, these two items, hard biscuit and trail mix. Uh, you can put it in inventory, you can bring it to the demon realm later, you can have them as food to recover your HP. Or uh, and for these two you eat them immediately to recover. I'm not gonna buy any of them because the inventory will be very full. And this story story will kinda help in the rumor. You ask the innkeeper if he has anything special to tell you. He nod and say, Let me tell you. You know what happened to the so-called champions? You know in response and you continue. Well, nobody ever come. Wait, wait, what? Well, nobody ever came. I seen twenty people departing over the course of my career, twenty years. None of them ever returned. Who know what happened to them? Some say they're abducted by an evil presence as soon as they set foot into the portal. He looked at you and sniffled. Truth be told, you go into being the champion of Vietnam, you will be sent to the so-called portal that was supposedly located in Mount Ilgas. I will miss your patron at the inn. You still will come anytime. I miss your I will miss your dick. I will miss your dick. Ooh, and here we go. We have a masturbate option. If we are oh I guess 
so if our last is around like 35 i think we will gain the option to masturbate so letting this option will make you attempt to manually masturbate in order to relieve your last you unless you are a magician you unless you are a magician you don't really need that much last you should masturbate away the last if possible because if your last is full you will get weakened and want to come so badly in the battle the monster will rape you and then you lose your item and everything if, if, if you're fighting a boss you might get a bad end so masturbate you make sure you are alone and strip naked you stroke your fair size cock eagerly bring it you stroke your fair size cock eagerly quickly bringing yourself to a full throbbing state you easily wrap a hand around your cock and start masturbating yeah it's just it's just a fucking one inch cock you stroke quickly pressuring your sensitive dick darting down to the front of the base of your cock the sensitive the, sen the sensation proved too much for you and you felt the tightness building in your twitching manhood growing rapidly you stroke furiously feeling the pressure of your cock as a near release pleasuring spavs overwhelm you as you come around from your pecker your hip jerk in the air in time with your eruption spraying calm in the air a few take spurt of burst from your loins spreading you liberally you quickly fell asleep span by masturbating we will lower the sensitivity sensitivity is a perk that we see in the beginning when, we, when i create the character mm, if you have high sensitivity if the monster has something that can touch you you will gain last much more quicker if your sensitivity is lower you won't gain last much more quicker that's why i think so uh, let's see what to do next um, I think we'll stop here for today this will be the episode 1 of Corruption of Champions see you in the next episode if you have any suggestion you can leave it down in the comment to tell me what to do uh, you can give me any order what what do you want my character to be doing or what kind of build do you want me to do or what kind of fetishes do you want me to go for Leave it all down in the comment section.